Assalamualaikum guys. So we are going to proceed with the next lesson, lesson 3. Uh, so on this lesson, as you can see here, we are going to learn on how to enter the opening balances and also on how to maintain the stock values. Um, previously, on the previous two lessons, uh, we already learned uh, on how to create the chart of account, on how to organize the batches uh, to enter the transactions by using the quick entry. And also, on the second uh, lesson, we have learned uh, on how to uh, maintain the data and creditors file. Uh, also, we already learned on how to view the reports, okay, especially the try balance, the ledger, the, the um, you know, uh, profit and loss account and also the balance sheet. Uh, so now, currently we are going to learn on this uh, third lesson, enter the opening balances and maintain the values. Uh, for the enter opening balances, uh, which means that uh, this company already have some data from the previous uh, period, accounting period, ataupun uh, from the previous month. Uh, so we want to pursue for the next month. So that is why we have to carry forward all the uh, balances from the pre previous one to the current one in order to proceed uh, the current transactions pull up. Right on the as for the uh, you know uh, first and second lesson, there are no opening balances because during first time computerized their accounting records. But now this company already have uh, some accounting records in the UBS. Uh, and they want to continue to record to the current period. Okay, so that is why other opening balances and we have to enter them. Okay, we have to key in lah maksudnya. Uh, so you have to ignore the first uh, instructions ni. Yang the first one ni, kita, kita ignore je because I would like you to create new company each time you do each um lesson. Setiap kali lesson baru, you buat new company. So as usual here at button and the company's name here adalah gun gun senyum berhad and the directory ikut suka you saya punya uh, ni lah maintain lah lesson 3 l3 and save button okay cancel and double click okay yes 100% okay and key in the password UBS and sign in. Okay, next, next setup letter and done. Okay, don't forget uh, after you have entered until this part, you have to do the company settings 711. Okay. Uh, change the company's name to Gun Senior Berhad here. And for the accounting year, you tengok dekat dia punya transaction. Okay. Since the transaction still a uh, January 2020. So, the previous year adalah 31 hari bulan 12, 2019. Masih lagi tak berubah lah maksudnya. Okay, sebab dia masih lagi menggunakan January. But we assume uh, this company already recorded the previous year punya accounting data atau accounting record. Right, so there is why uh, nanti diorang akan ada diorang punya opening balances lah. So these are the opening balances of this company yang this company uh, have. Okay, so since here um, semuanya dah betul, tak perlu diubah lagi dah, click OK. Okay, so the first thing that you need to do adalah create chart of account, right? So, uh, these are the accounts that you have to create. Okay, so as usual, you need to go to 1-1 one, one. and add button 1000 for the capital. Kalau you present dekat sini, account type is not given. So, meaning that by right, you already remembered. Um, Setiap account, okay, setiap account ini belongs to which account type. You should familiar lah. Supposedly sekarang ni dah familiar dah. Okay. Account type adalah A. Profit and loss account. Don't forget for the profit and loss account, they have this special account which is PA. Kalau previously, we used return earnings on the first lesson. Okay. 
So the account type still A. Oh, uh, before I forget, um, in the final exam, the account number is not given. Okay, and also uh, the special account as well as the account type is not given. They only provide you with the uh, accounts number. Uh, sorry, accounts name, the description. Right, okay, so for the accounts number, you have to create your own. Make sure uh, it will, uh, dia berada di dalam series yang betul lah. Kalau 1000 series, 2000 series, 3000 series dan sebagainya. Uh, according uh, to the accounts type. Okay. Furniture and fittings. Uh, this one I think first time lah you jumpa furniture and fittings which is dia akan berada di dalam D. Okay, fixed asset which is non-current asset right? Your furniture and fittings here. Okay, and save. Uh, save. 2020 refers to the office equipment. Masih lagi D. And save. 3000 for the data control which is belongs to F current asset. Okay, and 3010 bank punya still F and save 3020 deposit F Kalau you tengok 3000 series tu pun maksud dia still in the same account type lah tu. Okay. 3030 for the stock. Kalau you tengok 3030 ni stock kan. You tengok eh stock ini dia punya special account dia adalah BS. Okay. So in the final exam. Kalau you... Um, Tadi saya dah bagi tahu dah, uh, we are going to learn about the maintenance stock values, right? So, in the final exam, ni, you kena buat ni, stock, opening stock, and closing stock. And you have to make sure, you have assigned the special account for each of these stocks. Kalau stock yang berada dalam 3000 series, which is F current asset, uh, dia punya special account adalah BS. Bermaksud, amount yang berada di dalam stock account ini akan appear di dalam balance sheet. Okay, while for the opening stock, you tengok dia punya accounts number berada 6,000 series which is J, cost of goods sold. So, dia punya um, special account dia adalah OS and while for the closing stock, um, masih lagi berada dalam J, 6,000 series and the special account will be CS. CS refer kepada closing stock, OS refer kepada opening stock. Okay, kalau you tak buat this special account, you tak boleh maintain the stock values. Dia takkan appear nanti. Right?